Welcome to Veo's driver app training video. Today, we will demonstrate the Veo driver app. Our app was built to make trip assignment, trip completion, and trip finalization easy for providers and their drivers, dramatically reducing administrative burdens and helping to prevent fraud, waste, and abuse. The app streams dispatch from the Veo provider portal directly to drivers' phones in real time. Drivers can use their smartphone or tablet to view all of their trips for the day, review special trip instructions, access navigation using their preferred app, and capture and finalize trip data automatically. Once a trip is complete, the trip is automatically submitted for billing and payment arrives the following week. Please note that all members and protected health information shown in this demo are fictitious. Let's begin with how to dispatch trips to your drivers. To start, you must first accept trips in the provider portal. Begin by logging into the provider portal at providers.veo.com and going to the Accept Trips tab. Once your trips have been accepted, you can now go to the Assign Trips to Drivers tab. There are two ways to assign trips to drivers. You can either assign trips directly through the portal or you can upload trip assignments through an Excel spreadsheet. Let's look at the first option. To assign trips through the portal, start with the date filter. Select the date or range of dates for which you would like to assign trips. Now that you have some trips selected, you can assign a driver to them. Look at the driver column of the trip grid and click on the box that prompts you to enter driver name. Select a driver by entering his or her name or driver ID number or by selecting them in the drop down menu. Once you have selected a driver, the trip will automatically be sent to the driver's phone running the Veo driver app. The second method of assigning trips is through an Excel spreadsheet. Again, begin by checking the date filter and selecting the date or range of dates for which you would like to assign trips. Then, click the green export button at the top right to download an Excel file containing the trips that need to be assigned. You can assign trips to drivers in the Excel sheet by clicking on the cells in the driver column and using the drop-down menu to populate each cell with drivers. Make sure to save your Excel sheet once you're finished. Once all of the drivers have been populated, upload the Excel sheet to the portal by clicking the yellow Upload button at the top right corner. The portal will then display a summary of all trips that have been assigned. Trips that are assigned correctly will say pending, and incorrectly assigned trips will say failed. To fix incorrectly assigned trips, download the error file by clicking Download Import Results File and try the assignments again. After making changes, upload the file again. When all the assignments are made, review the import summary that shows the number of trips each driver was assigned. If it is incorrect, go back to the Assign Trips to Drivers tab and correct any mistakes. If the assignments are correct, click Confirm. Once trips have been assigned to drivers, the portal will automatically send the trips to the driver's phones that are running the Veo driver app. You have now completed the trip dispatch process. Now we will move on to using the driver app. Veo requires several documents and pieces of information to create app accounts for each driver. The documents include a list of drivers for each provider company with individual emails and phone numbers, a list of the company's vehicles, and copies of the vehicle registration, insurance, and inspection forms. You can check for device compatibility at partnerwithveo.com slash app. To log into the driver app, the driver will enter their email address or phone number. Their initial temporary password is set by Veo. To change the password, click Forget Password and enter the email address associated with the driver's account. They will receive an email address with instructions to change the password. Be sure to enable push notifications on the driver's devices so that they will receive real-time trip updates and notifications. Once the driver logs into the app, start by checking the overview of assigned trips. If no trips have been assigned, no trip overview available will be displayed. Press the refresh button at the top right of the screen frequently to show any newly assigned trips. 
Suppose the driver is ready to start driving for the day and has reviewed the trips for the day. Once they press Start Taking Trips, it will prompt them to log in with the vehicle they're driving. Enter the first few digits of the license plate or vehicle number and select the correct vehicle from the dropdown. The Confirm Vehicle screen will show the vehicle information, including the vehicle mode, and ask the driver to confirm that it is correct. If the wrong vehicle has been selected, press Wrong Vehicle to go back and select a different one. After the driver confirms their vehicle, they'll go to the schedule page, showing all trips for the day in time order. When the driver is ready to drive to the first pickup location, they should swipe from left to right on Begin Pickup and confirm. A trip instructions pop-up will prompt the driver to confirm trip or member-specific information. These in instructions are important, so please read them carefully. After reading the instructions, check all of the boxes and hit Confirm. For additional information on a trip, press the icon that looks like three dots at the top right corner of the screen. You can select a GPS navigation app of your choice by hitting the arrow icon on the bottom right. The apps that will be shown depend on what the driver has installed on their device. Veo uses Google Maps to determine trip distances and fares. Upon arrival at the pickup location for the first member, the driver once again swipes left to right on Arrived at Pickup. The driver should then call the member and meet them at the door to assist them into the vehicle and provide any additional assistance specified in the trip instructions. If the member does not answer their phone, they must be sure to knock on the door and wait at least five minutes after arriving or after the scheduled pickup, whichever is later. If the driver is at the wrong location, a pop-up will notify them that they are more than one mile away. After the member is safely in the vehicle, swipe left to right on Pickup is Done and proceed to the drop-off location. As always, the driver should keep conversation light and neutral. Avoid topics such as religion, politics, and members' personal lives. After arriving at the drop-off location, the driver should assist the member out of the vehicle and to the door, following any special trip instructions. After the member has been safely dropped off, swipe from left to right on Drop Off is Done. When a trip is complete, it will appear in the Done Trips section at the bottom of the schedule, as well as the bottom of the trip overview. The Veo Driver app has several additional features, such as the ability to cancel a trip, to cancel a trip, press the three dots icon to view the trip details, then press the options button at the top right of the screen. After pressing cancel trip, choose from the list of reasons for the cancellation and then type a detailed description of why the trip was canceled. They overviews this information, so please be as accurate as possible. If you are multi-loading members in your vehicle, just swipe Begin Pickup, Arrive to Pickup, Pickup is Done, and Drop Off is Done for each member in the same order in which they are being picked up and dropped off. Be sure to swipe at the correct time and location for each member to avoid problems with the trip data or app. Also, make sure that drivers do not swipe through all of the stages of the trip at once. If they do this, the trip data may look fraudulent and will be flagged for investigation. You can also access Veo's Accident and Incident Report form directly from the app. Feel free to contact us at providers at veo.com with any portal or app related questions and reach out to us at provider support at veo.com with trip related questions and issues. We appreciate your feedback. Thank you for partnering with Veo and being a part of the next generation of patient transportation.